Welcome back. Uh, we've got a new project to show off here. What we're looking at is my new mini uh, tricopter. It was made from the wreckage of my old FPV 250 here. I uh, toasted it about a week ago flying around when I lost a motor. So I realized I had enough parts on it that if I cannibalized it, uh, I could go ahead and make another vehicle. So I made this little tricopter. It's just over 250 millimeters from post to post, a little bit longer from the front to the back. Um, so it's right around the same class as these FPV 250. Uh, and it's made out of wood. We've just taken a triangular piece of plywood here and bolted on some dowels and glued onto it and then taken some motor mounts. Now, in the back, we've got a roller wheel there. That roller wheel is actually from a screen door. I got that at the hardware store and it's just bolted into the... Um, let's see if I can focus here just bolted into the end of the wood there and then uh, it's got a little um, linkage that I got off an old HK450 class a helicopter there hooking it to the servo now the nice thing about this wheel is that it's got a bearing built into it and the white parts built in nylon so it's really easy to grind on and drill into and all that it ended up working out real nice the only bad thing about it is that it's just a tad bit heavy for our purposes Going over to the electronics here, uh, it's pretty basic. We've got our radio, our flight controller that's a Creus version 2, not my favorite flight controller, but the one I had lying around. And then we've got our GPS right there and our three speed controllers. And that's about it. It's very basic um, and it tends to actually, oh, it's got the power module also, and it flies pretty good. Go ahead and show you hover here. Okay, let's go ahead and plug this in and we'll show you hover. Sometimes takes a second to 